Let's open it this way. Okay. Wow, look at this. And here we have it. The Steam Deck OLED. Okay. Hey everybody, uh, Sean here, and today's the day. Um, well, in uh, today's gonna be just unboxing videos of uh, Steam Deck OLED. Now, I am actually kind of excited about this, and uh, here we are, and uh, we have two of them. I, you can't see it in the screen, I'm sorry about that. But uh, this is my old one, I had this for about a year really great you know device over here uh so i mean long story short you know uh to me handheld gaming is a big thing because people at our age are pretty much busy and handheld gamings are what's thriving these days and i don't know what you know sony's thinking about with their playstation portal but you know thinking that it's not but no they're they're wrong about that because you know what people these days are just darn busy you know what i mean and we got to have steam deck used to have the nintendo switch because that was like the only available thing for uh you know portable options but once when i got my first steam deck uh nintendo switch bit the dust pretty badly anyway i really enjoyed the heck out of this thing because i am a huge pc player and I have so many games in my Steam library. And I happened to, you know, once when I got my Steam Deck, man, guys, it's like one of the uh, most impressive things that I have, you know, ever experienced whenever it comes to technology. It's just really impressive. And here it is right here. I'm gonna go ahead and take the case out. This is my old Steam Deck. So this is just a little bit of quick, I guess, preview thing. And this is like the top tier of my, um, of this model here. And, uh, here we is, uh, here it is over here. Uh, <laughs> my original Steam Deck right here. I have so many installed. This is the top tiers, uh, of the, the original model. And it was wonderful, great. I believe it was 512 or somewhere around there gigabytes. I totally forgot. Forgive me, correct me if I'm wrong. Yes, I had a little, you know. I uh, had a little water as a nub for the, uh, the joysticks. Fantastic device, great device. What I have, you know, over here, and yes, I have quite many on my uh, library here. So that's what we have in dealing with. It came with the case, okay, and uh, back of it, you know, I had a great bin. I'm actually was actually, um, you know, another great thing about. Uh, Steam Deck is why it's probably the best whenever it comes to handheld gaming PC is because man look it's by Valve right and Valve is pretty much encouraging all the people who buys this to modify your own Steam Deck which I have not done yet but man I can't wait to get into it you know uh, I bought myself like a new shells for it to and there's like a little hole over here so the, you know the vent to keep from you know the heat piling up in the back but, but for for us to give us this kind of options, you know, man, only Valve, you know, does this, you know, for us. It's probably probably one of the most, or ever, that is uh, consumer friendly in companies, and this is why we buy them. Okay, we this is not why you know we don't really buy other, or most of us or whatever, and we're depending on you know. <laughs> What people prefer this is why i buy steam deck it's because these valve um company is so supportive of you know people for the owners and for us to up, update them so i'm gonna put this over here with the case finally this thing came in today package this is gonna be the steam oled version this is also the top tier and all right so like i said before this is the uh the previous one it opens this way, but apparently this one is a little different. It faces this way, but the handle's down like this, but instead of this way, this one is the opposite direction. So let's open this up. There's a flap here with the Velcro. That's very nice. 
Okay, so this is gonna be my uh, my previous Steam Deck version. And we're gonna open this together, which just came in today. It's my Steam Deck OLED. And this is also the top tier. Brand new, kind of feel like the same it was before when I got it last year, which is really wonderful. It is Christmas. Well, not really, not yet, but this is pretty much my early Christmas gift. Here's the box, strong box. And I'm gonna put this aside. And here we are. Uh, this came with, of course, the charger. Yeah, let's open this up real quick. It's one of those circle stickers, which I do hate whenever it comes to packaging. But I can understand why. I don't have much nails, so. <laughs> There we go. Got it. Let's open this sucker up. Yep, we got the charger. And this is a little different. Oh, it's kind of a little new now, actually. This time it's got the uh, the Steam Deck icon on this charge port now. Uh, the previous one doesn't. So they kind of updated on this too, maybe? Hmm. We'll look more into it later, I guess. And here he is, the big one. And let's give it a try and open this up. Very beautiful, very beautiful packaging, your games, and a whole new light. Actually, you know what? It does feel kind of a little light this time. Oh, look at this, it's got the valve tag. I think it had it on the previous, yeah, I believe it did. I, I believe so. And look at this. Now let's compare this, shall we? With the... Let's compare this with uh, <laughs> the previous one and the modern, or not the modern, the, the old one. Look at that. Pretty much kind of the same, except, huh. Oh, I'm sorry. Facing this way, that's right. Pretty much the same, except now it's orange now. This is where you're supposed to put your charging ports here. I still love it. I'm still gonna keep both of my Steam Deck, of course, because Steam Deck is amazing. And yeah, you got this right here to put your... Oh, I love the smell of a new uh, electronics. I mean, who doesn't, right? All right, let's open this up. So, previous, boom. So what we got. What I notice is, huh, it actually, instead of opening towards the bottom that I'm more used to, it's actually open on this way. So that's kind of interesting. Oh, wait a minute. It's got this little flap with the Velcro on it. Huh, that's kind of new. Oh, I gotta take this off first. Uh, let me get back to you guys after I open this, uh, let's open it this way. Okay. Wow, look at this. And here we have it, the Steam Deck OLED. Okay. So I guess uh, we can take a quick look at it. I don't want to power on just yet. I want to wait till I get the uh, the screen first. Like I said, this is just an unboxing video. And uh, we can take a look at the difference real quick. So I opened this, just faces differently. Huh. I thought it was supposed to come with one of those. Ah, I see. But you know what? The case itself for the outside feels more premium on the previous version than the OLED one. Feels a lot thinner on this one. So, I mean, that's it. Did I say it's an upgrade? Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, so it does come apart this way. Okay. Ah, I don't know, man. I just have a feeling because you can feel all the cushion and stiffness on 
you know, on this side, feels a lot more durable on here, but here it's like, you pop it off, it's like, you can this you, you can tell this is the other side of it. I mean, yeah, they both have the little empty spots that, you know, but like there's so much cushion and so much more sturdiness that is built in the, the previous one, except that this one separates. That's all it is, I think. So they just, it's not like, you know, I understand like a lot of uh, reviewers say that, you know, you get extra, you know, cases. It's not the case. They just somehow seem to just make it separable now this time. So, but not bad. I think they did this so that you'll be able to carry more lightly and more portable on it. And Mimi, like that is here. So let's this up here's what we have here this is what we have and yeah the screen is a little bit wider I can see it now and uh, let's see if I can uh, let's uh look at around it so here this is the old one yes Mimi let's look at the new one real quick oh this is new the power button is a little different now. See, it's orange this time. That's cool. And it's about this, yeah, it's almost pretty much identical except the color and, hmm, I don't see much of a difference. I see, I see a little difference. Hmm. The joystick is now black instead of gray color now. And the buttons are more dimmer in color. It feels more clickier than the previous version. So, this is Mimi, and this is Mimi. She's curious. Of what I'm doing. All right. Uh, I just really noticed this feels a little bit lighter than the previous one for some reason. Now this, I can feel the button is a little mushier on this side than this one. This feels more clickier. And oh, this feel oh the touch pads feels really interesting. This feels lighter. Yeah, it does feel a lot lighter. Let me take these nubs off. Something feels, yeah, it feels really interesting. There's a difference here. All right, I guess I can turn it on real quick. Okay. Okay, the light looks more brighter than the previous one. It's not on now, it's just gonna... Huh. Oh, the, sh the, 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 the shoulder button feels a lot more interesting. I also noticed there's some kind of like a camera on both sides of the screen now. Oh, you, can't, you won't be able to see it on the camera. I don't think it's gonna show up on the camera. But I can see a little bit of like a hidden camera like on both sides of the screen. Now, I don't know if it's camera or not. But that's something we're gonna have to find out on the next video or something. Ah, that sucks. I can see a little hair. That sucks. Okay. Alright. Yeah, so this is just one of those things I'm gonna have to. Whoa, I've noticed something. Look at that. Huh. Hold on. Oh, I can see the difference when it comes to like black. This feels more. This one looks a lot more darker in black color. It's more clear now. I can see it. 
Okay, I can understand it now. That's really nice. Well, I guess I have to set this thing up first. What are we, Pacific? Hmm. Here it is. Uh, I'm not gonna reveal this, guys. Oh, there's nothing much I can do right now to show you guys because this is just out of the box. So it's a uh, setup for a moment. As far as what I feel right now, um, I don't know. I hear that the track pads are now more improved and better in point on right now which is wonderful for me because I do play like city building games or Kenshi or like FPS game that I'm used to using a touchpad on my previous Steam Deck because it's like you can, you know, when once you get used to using a trackpad on like a Steam Deck, for example, oh man, it helps a lot on the FPS, trust me. And this, wow, man, I just can't wait to try this out. And, uh, it feels so much lighter. It really does. And it feels more clickier. Um, oh, I, it feels... The touchpad I just pressed in... It, it feels really responsive. The vibration to it just feels so nice, actually. I really like this. This is really nice. I wonder, I can see that there's a new feature with this because I don't see any of these. It's definitely a camera. I think it's gotta be a camera. It looks like a lens on both sides, right here and right here. You can't see it with the camera, but you can definitely see it with the naked eye. Yeah, this is really nice. I love the color. Uh, man, you know what? I have a feeling because how Valve really supports us on modding this thing, I bet you they have like a blue button, <laughs> blue power button that's gonna come out, which is gonna be so awesome. So, blue is my favorite color. And um, yeah, I really can't wait to get onto this. I don't know when this film or the protection screen is coming, but tell you what, uh, yeah, feels lighter. Uh, man, the screen looks so beautiful. I mean, it, it, the color it just pops out, and I just already feel the different. But the first thing I noticed when I was holding both of these at the same time, man, this feels so much. This feels not so much, but it feels lighter than this one. And I don't know what to tell you guys. I'm really excited. The buttons, uh, it's more grayed out on the um, the X Y A B button. Uh, thumbsticks has been changed to from color to from gray to black. Feels more clicker, but yeah, this I'm gonna have to go through all the setups. But that's the idea, everybody. So, ladies and gentlemen, uh, thank you for watching this. Sorry, I'm not gonna like do all the boot ups and playing yet because I really want to wait till I get a screen, uh, the screen protector to film it out and then I will get on with it. So, Hopefully, uh, here, it is, here it is right here. And I hope that um, even Mimi wants to play this thing, that we will um, see if we can see the inner of it. And we will get on with it. Yes, Mimi. Yes. Thanks for watching, guys.